Hey, folks, how's it going? We're checking out Bottom Season 3, Episode 4. So after this, guys, two more episodes, and the show will be done. So make sure you guys cast your votes from the polls. Come out for the new um, for the new shows. And then also, I know a lot of people have been asking for shorter shows. Um, like, like, I think it's Faulty Towers, Alan Partridge, and it's another one. Black Books, I think it is. People saying, like, oh, they hope those make it so that... Um, because the other ones, of course, take longer. And it'd be cool to just get those out of the way. And then we can do the long ones. Me, personally, I like the long ones. Just because I get to stay with those characters longer. And when I when I get become a part of, like, a, a show... I just say part of that universe. When I get part of, like, the Only Fools universe or Peep Show. Or Inbetweeners or IT Crowd. I crave more of it. So it stinks when it's over, you know? So I do like the longer shows. Uh, but I, I get why so many people want the shorter ones out. So hopefully a few short ones make it up the list. And, but selfishly, I'm hoping Red Dwarf makes it um, to the top this time for one of those slots. I'm definitely looking forward to checking out Red Dwarf. Unfortunately, Red Dwarf will never make it on YouTube because I, I did a clip of it and it was blocked. I put it on Daily Motion and I was given a copyright takedown for it. Um, so, yeah, I think it was, the, I think it was um, Red Dwarf to give me a takedown notice. That's the only problem with Daily Motion. You have to go check and just see which video is missing because they don't tell you which one. It's, it's, yeah, it's kind of janky. Um, they give you a link, but when you click on the link, it doesn't have a title or nothing. It just says this video is taken down. But, yeah. So, that's going to be much harder. I think unless I mute some parts and, like, really clip it down to, like, five seconds here. But it gets to the point where it's almost pointless. It's almost gets to that point now where a lot of shows me trying to get on YouTube. It's almost pointless to so how much I have to clip it down. But, yeah. That's what I'm hoping for. So, make sure you guys cast your votes. Let's just go ahead and jump into this. And, um, yeah. See how it goes. I could have written that. I would have done too if that Tolstoy bloke hadn't sneaked in first. If you know, I'd have jazzed it up a bit, put a few nudie pictures in and a couple of car chases. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't have called it War and Peace either. I'd have called it something more appropriate, like a load of old bollocks. <laughs> <laughs> what is he up to in there? <sighs> oh, God, I'm so bored. <sighs> oh. yeah. Oh, all right, off we go again. Leon <laughs> Tolstoy. Jeez, how bored you got to be to keep reading the same book. I wrong, didn't they? <laughs> I'm going to count to three, and then I am going to have a ruddy good look through that keyhole. <laughs> One, two, two, three. No, they put the grossest sounds. I'm lonely. I haven't had anyone to talk at for a whole week. What are you doing in there? It's just a little hobby of mine. Why don't you go and do yours? Well, I've had five this afternoon already. Ugh. baked beans but I thought wouldn't it be funny like if there was just one baked bean because then it'd be a misprint <laughs> it's the end I was thinking oh 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 so stupid <laughs> terrific especially when you see what the Duke of Edinburgh's up to on the back of the tenor <laughs> who's that with him Meryl Streep <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, she's got three uh. lockers. No, that's Bobby Charlton in the middle. <laughs> drinks all round. Well, of course there's drinks all round. It's a pub. No, I, I mean, drinks all round us. What are you having, boys? Palpitations. Has he seen the cash yet? Oh, it left you. So help me, I'll swing for you. <laughs> oh, I'm very busy. <laughs> no, you're not. I know, but I've been on a publican's refresher course in customer relations. Uh -huh. So... 
Come on, hurry up! And order, you time-waiting parasites, or I'll set the dogs on you! Yeah, boys? <laughs> half a mild. Uh, same for me in a pint glass, please. Yeah, I'll have a pint of mild in a half pint glass. <laughs> well, uh, no way this shit's like them, them. Uh, I think the light's a bit better in the toilets. Uh, hey, uh, what's the bar for me? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Can't believe that shit works. This is shit. <laughs> like, what did you get for not picking up this? Roger Henderson. Basically, he says that unless you stop printing and come up with five grand by closing time tonight, Damn. he's gonna come round here and crush your skulls. <laughs> is that bad? <laughs> and that's why they call him the Skull Crush. Exactly. <laughs> so, uh, till tonight, gentlemen. I think I need to go to the lavvy. Yeah, me too. And me. I'm just being. <laughs> <laughs> Christ, Eddie, what are we gonna do? I know what I'm thinking. Well, we'll come back next week then, shall we? This is gonna hurt you a lot more than it hurts me. I had an idea it might. <laughs> are you off? No, just getting a good run up. <laughs> A lot of teeth. How is that? Wrong side. Oh, the things I do for you. Oh. <laughs> Spit. Uh. <laughs> 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 it's so gross. <laughs> Haven't you got? I've got about three. Oh, good. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, shit. Nursey Jug Fest on table number two. <laughs> hey, Richard! <laughs> just had a great plan. Run with it, Eddie. You are the Shit. launch machine. <laughs> Hi, birds. Oh, dear. I seem to have inadvertently dropped my keys under your table. You don't mind if I bend down and have a quick get of them, do you? Perverse. <laughs> yeah, well, I am now. <laughs> well, come on, come on. Oh, shit. This what did you great. see? Is it true? <laughs> oh, dear, everyone. I seem to be putting on so much weight these days. Did nobody was looking at you. <laughs> To you. <laughs> Concentrate, guys. This is going to be a bitch. Right. Here we go. First <clears throat> question. Brace yourselves. <laughs> Where are the Appalachians? <laughs> it's the wrong answer. I can hand it over for a bonus point. <laughs> the same answer the CID gave. <laughs> right, moving right along then. Christ, I think he stopped breathing. All right, choir, please. What, and I'll repeat that, what is the square root of an hundred? <laughs> Which is the greater, two dozen or a score? Daffodils. Wrong. It bloody is. No, it isn't. <laughs> Are you calling me a liar? No, I'm calling you a tosser. <laughs> well, that's okay. You've got bandages. See, Rich? 
The plan's working brilliantly. They're all too busy looking after the dying and wounded. This is where we close in for the kill. <laughs> yeah, yeah, get them out of here. And watch the blood on me sawdust, won't you? Somebody in there? Yeah. Well, you're not supposed to be as out of order. Not as out of order as I am. Oh, gross. <laughs> And if I may say so, what a smashing blouse you have on. <laughs> oh, look, there's your five grand. Looks like 20 grand, doesn't it? It's bibbling about so much. Uh, well, it's been a pleasure doing business with you. Uh, if, well, look at the time, yes, Eddie. We must dance. Charming evening. Is that the door behind you? <laughs> Hang on. Oh, is there some sort of uh, problem, officer? I can't take this. It's forged. What? It's not. Yes, it is. I'm the one that forged it. Look, <laughs> that ain't the queen. It's Danny LaRue. Well, it's a queen. <laughs> Can you? Would that do? Afraid not, boys. It's go crashing time. <laughs> <laughs> that was a really good episode, man. Ah, <laughs> uh, that was a good episode. Richie was so desperate for attention. It was. <laughs> When he started singing in like the hallway singing, trying to like sing Eddie's name, it was like when Tay this reminds me of Tay like if I'm like really, really focused on something when like I'm not paying attention to her at all. And um I'm not saying she's like needy or nothing. But like if I sometimes I do that, I'll be working on like a project or something like that, and I'll be on it for hours and we're supposed to like, you know, I mean, see, I always do a thing where, like, she's working on her stuff and working on mine, and which was, like, you know, reconvene, you know, like, to hang out, like, to watch a movie or something like that. But I get so wrapped up in my stuff, I forget, and she'll do something, like, goofy like that to get my attention, so I thought it was funny. Like, she'll just sing my name at the top of the stairs or something like that, so that was funny. I don't, that cracked me up, because he was so freaking desperate. Oh, no, man, this is a funny episode. There's a whole lot of, like, goofy shenanigans going on. Um, I didn't expect him to get electrocuted by the buzzers. I honestly thought he just, like, shut him off or something. So that was stupid. That was stupid and funny. Um, I don't know. All around good when he was humping that fishbowl. I think it was fishbowl <laughs> on the table. He was enjoying it a little too much. Uh, this is a good episode. It was super wacky and fun. I really enjoyed this a lot. Oh, man. Stinks. Only two more episodes of Bottom. Only two more episodes of Wackiness. I'm hoping whatever show... I'm hoping at least one show that gets voted in is wacky. I know nothing can really compare to the bottom. Um, I just put the in there. Don't kill me. I can't think of anything, like, yeah, I don't think anything could, like, compare. Based, at least based on the shows I've seen pop up and how what people explain what they're about, it don't it doesn't seem like any of them are even close. Um, but who knows? Something might pop up that is similar. I don't know. You never know. Yeah, that'd be cool. You don't have to be exact, but just something just real simple just real goofy you know dick and fart jokes it's a couple of horny guys being a shot at each other yeah but i know a few people said this show is very unique so um except for somebody somebody said that they have some earlier work that's not kind of similar to it that's been mentioned to me on youtube some of the earlier work i think it's uh like the dangerous boys or something like that i heard somebody said that and but they said it's not the same though but 
it's probably the closest thing I'll get when it comes to like that slapstick stuff, stabbing each other in the eye and hitting each other like that type of jazz. Yeah. All right, man. So the poll will be up soon. I'm definitely looking forward to seeing how it turns out. Um, I really enjoyed this episode, and hopefully you guys are happy, safe, and healthy. And I'll see you in the next one. Later.